Sorry about the reflection here, folks. I'm getting ready to feed the observation hive, and I wanted to share it. It's about 54, 55 degrees. Sunny day, bees are out flying. And real quick, I'm going to open this and stick this frame in it. Okay, so here's what I've done. I've taken this frame, which is a standard deep frame that I've converted to hold two of my mini nuke frames. That way, when I'm not using my mini nukes, these frames can still be in circulation with bees on them to protect the comb from wax moth or any kind of other damage. So, you can see there is some cap stores here. Well, around these cap stores, I've taken and poured some uh, sugar water, two to one mixture, and I filled in these remaining remaining holes here. And I did the same on the back, as you can see here. Now what I want to do is stick this in the observation hive today. I see they're a little light on food and we're starting to lose uh, large quantities of bees on the bottom, so. Very interesting, we're here within the observation hive. We've got bees flying everywhere. And what do I see as soon as I open the door? Wax moth larvae. Never gave this any consideration. It's not cold enough in the house to kill the wax moth larvae. So they are they are living down here on this bottom frame. I'm gonna get rid of this mess right off the bat. Okay, it's about five, six hours later now. Brought the bees in and they've adjusted. It's cooled back down outside. We're reminded that we're still in winter. But as you can see on the back side here, still got a pretty decent cluster. If you look right in there, you see the queen. Nice and healthy. Nice thick cluster of bees right here. Not a whole lot. I've lost quite a few just in the last day or two due to food stores. They just ate so much in the last couple days. It's, it's amazing. I was really amazed by them uh, wax moth larvae too. Never gave that any thought. So, as spring comes along, I'm sure they'll draw that out. The queen will lay some eggs in here, in these frames. And after that happens, I plan to take this whole frame out and start me a little mini nuke with those two frames replacing it with another full frame full deep frame so that's that's my intentions for spring so got to get these to last till spring so we can keep the live action going with the bees and while I'm thinking of it if you, if you like these videos let me know thumbs up thumbs down